Tam 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 tam. It's Bo and Jana on the microphone. Yes, Talking we're here. Bubbly duck. We have some famous, very famous people here today that have been here for years. You're a new guy around here the uh, last couple of years? I'm definitely relatively new the last couple of years, and I'm very glad to be a part of the 20th anniversary at the VQ. It's wonderful, uh, quite ironic, the fact that there was war 20 years ago and war today. <laughs> but uh, let's just celebrate, come together, and uh, have a cocktail and not really worry about war. Oh, I was a 28-year-old kid out of Portland State, see? And is it true that they had purple brick walls in here? And gypsies lived here? No, they were orange, and I chipped all the plaster off with my hands and a chisel and a hammer. Uh, so I had that gun, that picture I had when I was on a scaffold, knocking the plaster off. <laughs> is Jim, is that all you have to say? Yeah, I had I had that picture. We just, it was too foggy, we couldn't, couldn't put, it, put it out. I so, can't believe you guys got all these balloons. Did Barb do this? Yeah, we got the tank over it. That, uh, your buddy, who says he used to come here and eat. And I helped, and Kevin helped. Happy birthday! 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 the two-layer cake. Oh. As you can tell, a very emotional moment for this man. I want you to meet my daughter. <laughs> I want you to meet my daughter. Dad! I know your daughter. Right here? Your daughter? Where? No. Oh going downtown. No, we are going downstairs. We are going to see Bo Zancanella, who orchestrated this fantastic event. He's somewhere down here, down in the deep, dark depths of the veritable quandary. We hear he's been hit by a Scud missile from the Iraqi forces. And there he is. Oh, he is so beautiful when he is sleeping. <laughs> he is such a tiny bird nestled in a tiny nest. His tiny little feet without the socks nestled in the tiny little loafers. We love you, Bo. Okay. We are here in front of the veritable quandary. We'd like to ask everyone, it is the 20th anniversary. You've known Denny King for a long time. What are your favorite memories of Dennis King? I'm still upset with Denny for cutting us off with a tequila about two months ago. <laughs> what, did he want it all for himself? Was there not enough to go around? Uh, he's just scared of what we do if we kept it. <laughs> is that right? That's right. You should be scared. Okay. Uh, uh, you two, you two, this is probably your first time here. First time Never been here. Perhaps, before. but just if, if you knew Denny King. No, but you know, if you knew Denny King, what would your favorite memories of him be? Well, from what I know of Denny King, I don't want to know him. Really? But if I did know him, the one thing I'd want to do is I'd want someday, I hope I can beat him in golf. I just once, I want to beat him in golf. That's you all think I he's do. that good? No, he thinks he's that good. He thinks he's that good. There you have it. There you have it. And you? Now, 
This is her husband is back it? here. I would like woman? to ask Denny where my husband's been all these years if he doesn't really know Denny. All these Friday nights that he claims to be with Denny. The inside story. And I would like to ask Denny what Steve and Denny were doing on Union Avenue several years ago on a Friday evening. Hi, Mom. Get in there. Hi, Mom. What are some of some of your fondest memories of Dennis King? <laughs> Don't ask. <laughs> fondest memories of Denny are when he picked me up when I was in second grade, and there was a rapist at my school, and he picked me up on his motorcycle. I hadn't seen him for two years, and he took me to the park and almost got arrested because they thought he was the rapist. <laughs> and I stood up to the cop and said, "He's not. He's not the rapist. He's my dad." <laughs> 20 years ago today, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, this is Dennis King's daughter, <laughs> the lovely, the charming Jennifer Bidwell, Jennifer Bidwell. She is 56 as well, yes. Looking good for 56. <laughs> hey, Ron is in here. So we're, we've got uh, the sprawling crowd, a cast of thousands here at the Veritable Quandary, waiting to get in, waiting and waiting and waiting and waiting, and waiting, and waiting. And now I'm risking my life for Dennis King. This will be my fondest memory, speaking for Dennis King when he says thank you for shopping the veritable quandary. Mm -hmm.